pair of happy trees. Sure is a pair of happy trees. It's the third happy tree. save the chicken. We'll try to get a 4 out of the Woggle next turn. You want to be buying a 2 on 3.0 anyway. You want to buy a 2 and a 3. This guarantees that we have a 2 in the shop that we want to buy. No. Oh, my Woggle. Also, I'm Tiger, so yeah, let's remember that we're Tiger and pick the Tiger treasure. Usually a good idea to pick the treasure that says win the game. Usually. My uh, my favorite podcast came back like two weeks ago, and I just found it yesterday. I was so excited when I saw this in my YouTube recommended. They talk about uh, magic game design. It used to be on Star City before they laid off all their content creation. It's been gone for like a year. But it's back now. You still like Cedric have a podcast? Yup. <laughs> it gets criminally low views. Even when it was on Star City, it was never super popular. 
but I imagine part of that is because of Star City being so diluted. There's like so much stuff on that channel. Because no one talks about it. <laughs> it's like not promoted anywhere. And it's been gone for a while. But I think their first video on this channel got more views than any of the podcasts on the Star City channel. So, hopefully it uh, goes better this time. Wait, we tie this? Oh, sick. Oh. I don't really know what I'm looking for here other than more Medusas. I could Woggle. It's like weird to commit to anything before knowing what's in the locked chest. XP. Medusa. aren't treasure map. <laughs> 20 years ago, yeah. Been around in the magic community forever. I guess I want another one. It's one gold. It's pretty hard to turn down one gold XP. He's so mad! Noble Steed. Eh. We're not triggering the Lance easily. Just have a Mim. I think I just want the tempo. Feels kind of bad. of glory. Yeah, but then I've got to find Lance and the Blaze of Glory before I want to replace another treasure. And I'm going into level 6.
All roads lead to pumpkin. There was never any doubt anyway, to be fair. This was always a pumpkin game. Evil pump addict. It's just so hard to be anything else. Buy trophy on her. <sighs> That's not a Medusa. Oh my god, a treasure map! I mean, we have no pairs. We still need to. We still need to get those. Kill some of these. Targets to hit. Not really. Tiger because of the Sark. I I probably should play it at some point. Like maybe we just play it here. Maybe we're most likely to skip, but may as well take a look. Get a dot on my bench. Shadow's a hit. Yeah, like Shadow is something we could get. Um Zell might be better. I think I'd rather be Tiger than Rumpel. Oh my! Oh my god. No, Medusa! We did it. There's a magic sword. 
Pretty good. Yeah, Tiger doesn't matter with the map, but the Tiger Sark is still relevant. That's non Grail hit. World Tree. That's usually how it goes. One is Grail, two is World Tree, and then three starts becoming situational. This is probably the third best. Lobbies. Yeah. It's like no one running away with it. What is this? This is a pants board? Hello? Even Pants is a pumpkin hero. What's going on? Let's see Big Pigs being better than Boom. Just because of the magic sword. This is the, the classic pumpkin comp. This is what 2021 pumpkin was all about. Best six by a lot. Or at least the best six to get quickly. It feels right as a seven. It's at that power level.
It's not even just good boy. It's also just Doom Breath. Magic Sword just plays well with so many comps. Instantly stabilizes you with Tweedledee nowadays, too. Before? What happened? Why'd he get rid of his best unit? 